Storm chances are going to pick up today, and we actually have a severe weather threat across the southeast into areas of the Carolinas, Georgia, Tennessee, Alabama, and even far back into Mississippi. It's all due to a stationary boundary just to our south, bringing in a lot of moisture both from the Gulf and potentially off the Atlantic as well. Plus, high pressure to our north is keeping temperatures a little cooler than usual, sending us a nice light breeze from the northeast, which wedges in that cool air right up against the mountains, and it keeps it in our area, creating a haze easy sky, some cloudiness and cooler than usual weather. Already locally, we're seeing rain showers begin to pick up in western North Carolina. The upstate and northeast Georgia are still dry. That'll change though, closing in on midday today. This is a look at noon on Futurecast. Mountain towns begin to see some heavier pockets of rain. The upstate starts to get in on lighter showers, and then everyone sees on and off active weather through the afternoon to early evening. Downpours and lightning are all possible. Now into the overnight, some of the heaviest rain could start to build in. So look at this at 8 to 9 o'clock tonight. Some of the worst rain just to our south beginning to move through. It could be midnight. It could be 3 a.m. or 5 a.m. into tomorrow and more of this wet weather is expected to build. So just future cast showing us this here that the overnight could be a little more active even than the daytime hours. The good news that we can tuck in and maybe avoid some of it, but there's a chance that uh, more showers and storms will develop into tomorrow afternoon as well. Right now it's in the 60s and lower 70s. Highs reach 81 in the upstate today with scattered storms. Mountain towns get to 75 degrees with scattered storms. So it's just not a great day and I'm going to rate it a 4 out of 10 on that Carolina sky meter. Going forward tomorrow will be very similar to today. 81 degrees again with storms. Then Saturday warms back up a bit as the rain chance stays a little more limited. And Sunday looks like the nicer day of the weekend even though you may still have to dodge a shower or thunderstorm briefly in the afternoon. We'll take another look at your forecast coming up, Mark Redan.